What's the deal with kill switches and why do motorcycles have them? It's certainly a question that I asked myself when I was first starting to look into bikes. It's nothing complicated and hopefully you'll learn some good safety tips along the way. Honestly, even if you're not a biker, you just operate any vehicle on the road, you should probably know some of the stuff in this video. So a kill switch can be found on all sorts of vehicles and machinery. You've probably seen a big kill switch button at your local gas station whether you even fully took notice of it or not. To put it simply, the kill switch is a safety mechanism used to shut down power to a device as quickly and easily as possible in case of an emergency. You might often see them labeled EPO as well, which stands for Emergency Power Off. On motorcycles specifically, the kill switch can come in handy in a number of situations, mainly with stuck open throttle issues, as well as if your bike ever gets laid down on its side while the engine is running. If you ever experience a stuck open throttle problem, whether it happens while you're in motion or not, that kill switch is always easily accessible with the thumb of your right throttle hand. Trying to fumble around with your key ignition to turn off the engine in a situation like this would just be very inefficient in comparison. Now if your bike gets laid down on its side with the engine on, again, hit that kill switch button ASAP. You don't want your engine running while gas starts leaking out of your horizontal bike. The other thing being that, depending on what kind of motorcycle you own, your key ignition might not be accessible to shut the engine off when it's down on its side. But the kill switch on the handlebars will usually remain easily accessible even at these times. Obviously, any biker would prefer to have an accident-free career, but they do happen out there. If you find yourself in a wreck, but you're okay and able to get up and move around, get over to your bike and hit that kill switch button again ASAP, then worry about picking it up. Additionally, if you're the person in the car or truck that got into an accident with a motorcyclist, if the rider is injured and they can't move, and only if the conditions are safe for you to do so, go hit that kill switch button on their motorcycle for them. They'll appreciate it.